Hi, I'm Lauren from our search team. Uh, oh, back one. And this is Alex from our geo team. Um, and we're really excited to share a little about knowledge panels today and how you can claim them and engage with them. So as we heard earlier this morning, um, billions of searches take place on Google every year. And many of those are about people and organizations. When searchers find the people and orgs that you represent, we want to give you the tools to make a great first impression with your knowledge panel. Um, next. Okay. So for those of you that are intimately familiar with knowledge panels already, indulge me for a moment. Um, and for those that may be new to knowledge panels, here's a quick overview. Um, but the knowledge panel is an information box that appears when you search for entities that are in the knowledge graph. People, businesses, things, places, locations, those. Um, they give you a quick snapshot of information on a topic based on Google's understanding of available content on the web. So if you hear about an awesome new restaurant or a great nonprofit and you come to Google, this is a quick way for you to learn more um, and get to know the topic. So based on the topic of the knowledge panel, there may be different information or features included. For example, if the topic of the knowledge panel is a business that serves a specific location or a service area, the knowledge panel may have options that are specific to businesses. Um, so we know that people and organizations with information included in knowledge panels, uh, like those that you may work with or represent, um, are authoritative on the topic. You are arguably one of the best authorities on yourself. And we have tools for you to provide direct feedback um, and suggest any additions or changes. Um, so the tools may look a little different based on the topic of the knowledge panel, but the first step is always to do a search and look for a prompt to claim. You'll be guided through a verification process where we validate that you in fact do represent that topic. Next. Um, so once you've claimed the knowledge panel, you'll wanna take a look at the info in it. Um, review that information and suggest any needed updates or additions. Um, in a study done with location-based businesses, they found that, inf that businesses that complete their information are twice as likely to be considered reputable by consumers. So this is definitely something that you want to do to make a great first impression if you haven't already. Um, so to suggest those changes, after claiming the knowledge panel, the next time you do a search for the, the person, the business, the organization that you represent, you'll see a special header at the top that invites you to suggest changes. When prompted, add any required information and documentation from the open web. Um, your suggestions will be reviewed by a dedicated team and you'll receive email updates along the way letting you know about the status of your suggestion. If you represent a business that serves a location, Alex is going to take you through that suggestion flow. Thanks, Lauren. Um, and so when you see something like this, uh, you'll be able to edit things like hours, customer service numbers, street addresses, uh, websites. The same information that shows up on the knowledge panel also shows up in Google Maps and other local search formats for Google. Uh, so this is a primary way for people to understand and identify the business and get in contact with it. Um, an important really part here is also making sure that once searchers finally discover or rediscover you, you should let them where, know where to go next uh, so they can continue their journey. Uh, depending on, again, the topic of the knowledge panel, you should be able to add things like websites, social media presence, so that searchers can take the next step in terms of finding you and discovering what you do. Um, engaging searchers is also super important. Um, and so we have a format uh, that allows for certain types of knowledge panels to create, and in, create content and engage with consumers and searchers on Google. Um, all those billions of people that were searching for you that Lauren mentioned, uh, they should be able to see those updates depending on the, top of the type of knowledge panel you own. They should be able to see those types of content immediately once you surface them in the knowledge panel. Um, and to get started, it's pretty easy. For people and brands, all you need to do is search for yourself, and you should be able to see the claim knowledge panel link. And then for businesses, local businesses, you should go to business.google.com. Thanks. Thanks.